Here is the famous curse of the Kaipeseth mummy. A mummy, quite an unusual inhabitant of a manor. It must be a knife for sacrifices. Ladies and gentlemen, let me thank you all for attending this special reception. In fact, this moment is a turning point for many people. Excuse me if I may. I am Sherlock Holmes. What do you wish to know? Let me introduce myself. I am Sherlock Holmes. Oh, Mr. Holmes, the infamous detective. We are heaven blessed by your presence. I am afraid I am still in shock. Good morning, Holmes. Looks like a typical London day. Fog in the morning, fog in the afternoon. Ha! And here's a surprise. Fog in the evening. Good morning, Watson. Pardon me. I'm looking for the Barnes Bookshop. Would you happen to know it? I know the place. Know it well, Mr. Holmes. The bookshop is on Glentworth Street. Take your first right and then the next left and you'll find it straight away. A book about sea fauna. A Sunset by Rubens, one of the greatest Baroque painters of the 17th century and in the history of painting in general. Where, my lovely, we'll have a right good time. Wait, let me help you. Oh, it's my hair that pleases you. London. At last, let's see the district of Whitechapel. I found the map, Holmes, and I was able to locate the Whitechapel police station. There is a black bonnet near the left hand. No marks on the ground. The ground is muddy. No signs of blood. Look at this poor woman more closely. Poor pool of blood, six inches in diameter. The tongue is swollen. There is a bruise on the left cheek. There is a bruise at the level of the right maxilla. The throat was slit from left to right. There are two incisions.
the murderer had enough room to inflict the wounds to the neck and these wounds suggest the left hand was used. A broken file and blood near the neck. The fingers have been crushed and violently struck. His stomach is covered in scratches. Quite evidently, they weren't made recently. You can see by his expression that he suffered terribly. Ah. His mouth is covered in blood, and I can make out strips of skin between his teeth. My dear friend, everything points to this man having gnawed at his own forearms. That's unbelievable, Holmes. Something is missing here. Oh, yes? And what might that be? His shoes. Watson, his shoes are missing. You have to help us, Mr. Holmes. This is my brother, Leighton. He's in a prison cell. They say he's killed two men. I left my work and decided to cut through off Moon Street. I saw two men. They were both lying flat in the middle of the street. And then, Mr. Holmes, something strange happened. I was blinded by a flash. And then I was caught by the police. The two men here, both shot. We've got the murderer, the weapon, and the statements. I saw no word about that man. The murderer. He was like a ghost, and all covered in blood. This wooden handle is plain and solid. This blood is from the pool underneath the dead body. Peter Carey tried to defend himself with this knife, but he did not succeed. I should go there alone. God save us. That's just your sick imagination. Really think I'm that naive? You turning up out of the blue and then bam, a murder. Holmes, she tricked me. She. Where's she gone? What's it? Where? I don't know. This fight will be a fierce one. Now that you control Sherlock Holmes, you can move to his wardrobe to change. As Sherlock is a master of disguise, some of the game's passages require you to modify his appearance in order to conduct your investigations incognito. For the moment, we'll just put on a simple overcoat. The area around Baker Street lets you appreciate the power of our technology, in particular, the use of physically-based rendering, which makes lights and textures seem more real than ever. Good day to you, Lord Marsh. This interrogation gives us the chance to show you how the character observation has evolved. Using Sherlock's extraordinary talents and your analytical skills, hunt down clues and make the right deductions in order to unlock additional options for the rest of the investigation. You may make the wrong deductions and miss precious clues. After you've found enough clues, you can open up Sherlock's deduction space, representing the famous mental palace of the celebrated detective. The deduction space presents all the clues you've gathered during the investigation and lets you combine them, so you can deduce your own conclusion to the investigation. 
Your interpretation of the clues is of critical importance, as it will have a major impact on your conclusion for the case. Each investigation can lead to several conclusions and, once you have confirmed it, you will have to face a moral choice. Your decision requires special attention as it will decide the future of some of the characters in the game. Mr Holmes? Tom, I'm so sorry I have sad news. My father! 